How about New Jets tackle Morgan Moses' custom farmhouse, which includes his own gym and recovery center? Feels like that could be an offensive line bonding time in the farmhouse, wherever that may be. The Jets add to their offensive line with the addition of Morgan Moses. And you know that with Joe Douglas at the helm, the offensive line is always looking to improve. Yeah, and Morgan Moses, the Jets are getting a tackle, started every game each of the past six seasons for Washington. Moses is 6'6", 330 pounds, and he graded out his pro football focus as 18th best tackle last season. His pro football focus run blocking grade of 84.7 actually ranked 7th amongst all tackles in the National Football League. When the Jets were rumored to have interest in Moses, head coach Robert Sala said, He's an outstanding player. He's played at a high level. He indicated the Jets wouldn't be shy from adding good football players, and GM Joe Douglas got the deal done. All right, so this begs the question. The next one, the natural one, is what does this mean for George Fant, who started at right tackle last season for the Jets? Bottom line here is the signing helps the Jets in two ways. The Jets like George Fant, and they think he will be good in this wide zone blocking attack. If Moses does indeed start at right tackle, though, then the athletic fan who started a career-high 14 games last season could become a valuable swing tackle for the Jets. Like Fant, Moses is a true professional who lives by the mantra, your best ability is your availability. The former third-round pick out of Virginia takes his craft very seriously, and so much so, he built a farmhouse that features a gym, a recovery center, infrared sauna, and hyperbaric chambers. I feel like we gotta go see what that's about. I wanna see photos, maybe take a little tour, but what does this mean now for the Jets' tackles in terms of a total landscape? Because now the depth gets better, and like you said, they can use Fan as a swing tackle, and you have Makai Becton, and then also Morgan Moses. Feels like the Jets are in a good spot. Yeah, I think so. Makai Becton had a quiet spring. He was dealing with the foot injury. He hired a personal chef. We talked about that before. He's eating the right things. Sala has talked about the importance of all the young players progressing and taking care of their bodies, eating right, working out right, staying hydrated, and doing all those things that lead to longevity. Enter Morgan Moses. He should be a great influence. And just think how big the Jets tackle tandem could be if they start the 6'7", 360-something Becton on the left with 6'6", 330-pound Moses on the right. No matter what happens with Moses' fan, the Jets have gotten better with this addition. All right, Morgan Moses, the new addition to the team. And for your full coverage, be sure to check out NewYorkJets.com.